As of today, the CME FedWatch tool is pricing in a 75% chance of the Fed cutting rates by 25 basis points and a 25% chance of a 50 basis point cut at their meeting next week. However, which is the right amount for both the market and the economy? Though the jobless rate was close to a five-decade low in June, consumer spending is solid, and the overall expansion is now the longest on record, the market is begging for a reduction in rates. Fed officials are extremely concerned about sluggish growth abroad, ongoing trade issues, and a decrease in business confidence. Both stocks and bonds have rallied in recent weeks on the hope of a Fed rate cut, and any deviation from the Fed Reserve's dovish path is likely to halt the rally in its tracks. A quarter point cut could be described as the desired Goldilocks scenario for the markets as long as the Fed leaves open the door for possible future cuts. However, a 50 basis point cut could have the opposite effect, as the Fed might just be suggesting that the economy is in a more dire position than it is currently in.